Good evening, everybody. I'm sitting outside enjoying my day off here at the house. It's cold this morning. Birds are singing. Matter of fact, they're singing right now. This is my NFL message. And I didn't want to post it and write it in writing. I wanted to actually say it in person, so that's why I made this video. You see that? It stands for Virginia Tech. That's college football. That's what I watch now. Unless they start kneeling, then I'll boycott college football. As far as the NFL goes, they can go to hell. That's the bottom line. I'm making this video so you'll understand what I'm saying and what I mean. A lot of you still watch NFL football, and that's your right here in America. That right was, divide, was provided to you by soldiers that died to protect this freedom in this country, to keep foreigners from coming over here on our land like in Iraq, Afghanistan, Pakistan, and bombing the hell out of us. They defended all that to keep them from coming over here. That's what the military does, protect our country. So that's why you can watch football on TV for them ones that gave all and them ones that do serve. I've served, my two brothers served. I just lost my two brothers this year and they both defended this country. So I'm gonna defend their right today and everyone that has served or that has gave all so here's what i'm saying you have a right here in america to watch football that was provided you by veterans but however i'm in the middle of boycotting the nfl and i'm serious so if you're still going to watch football by your right which i'm not mad you can watch football that's your right that's what freedom's all about. But I'm asking you, as a friend to a friend, don't post on my wall the games, how well they played, or anything like that. If you have to post it on your wall how well your team played and the scores, then defriend me. That way I won't see it on my wall. Respect me for my wishes, and I'll respect you for yours. As of right now, when me and Lisa go into a restaurant, if there's an NFL game on a football screen, I will request to be removed from that table where I won't see it. I hope everybody keeps on boycotting and the ratings go down. Nobody shows up in any stadium across this country. You got people out there, families, that has lost a mother, a father, a brother, a sister, an aunt, an uncle, a cousin, a friend that has died for this country. They cannot watch NFL football. But they provided that freedom for you to watch that football. For all you NFL players out there, you're pathetic. And you can keep on kneeling. My dream is that you go bankrupt. Or your million, uh, your million dollar contracts every year go to a dollar. That's my dream. I will never watch NFL football until they all start standing in respect. But for the NFL commissioner to start talking about it is only because the ratings went down and the sales have went down. That's not respect. It's all about money. Bottom line, all about money. Colin Kaepernick has filed a grievance because no team has picked him up since he had Neil. If I was the arbitrator, the grievance be denied. You stay at home. You sorry piece of crap. These soldiers go fight for our freedom so ISIS terrorists and people cannot come into America remember 9-11 people you should always remember 9-11 it could happen again but since our military has got wiser and stuff not that much going on yeah you have a few pop ups here now in America uh, the social services San Bernardino you know terrorist act all that Killed 14 of them. But that's why we have soldiers. They don't carry a football. They carry a rifle. To defend your freedom. For you to be able to have freedom to watch football. So again, please do not take this personally. Take it as a wish that I'm asking for. Not to post any NFL games, scores, or anything on my wall. And if you have to post it on your wall... Just defriend me, and I promise you, I'm not mad about that. 
Because that's your right here in America. That's what they fight for, for your right. Lisa's son is overseas in a foreign country. I can't say where he's at because of mission that he's on. But I'm going to tell you something. I respect him. I respect my brothers that passed away that defended this country. And I respect everyone that has died for my freedom. I fought for your freedom, but I'm still alive. Thank God. So please, I'm asking you. What I'd like to see on my wall is boycotting the NFL. That's what I really want to see on my wall. But that's your choice. But as far as my choice, I want to do everything I can in every possible way to defend what these soldiers and families has done for me and you. I'm going to respect it. We stand for the national anthem, period. And God bless America. Thank you for listening. And may God bless you.